How you doing? This is your host, Philip the Holy Ghost, Prophet Sean Mars. I'm here. We're talking about miraculous results. I'm here with Apostle, Apostle Carlos Bound from Tabernacle on Fire Church out here in Houston, Texas. We have a testimony about a resurrection. We have an eyewitness account of the woman of God, uh, a testimony of what she saw when me and her were on the phone uh, while she was at the hospital. The woman of God? It is an honor just to just to testify of the goodness of God and how powerful our words are. Yes. And I just thank God at that time I was on the phone with the prophet. Yes. Let me tell you what happened. We had a relative in the hospital. And all of a sudden while I'm on the phone with Prophet Sean, we're talking about sign wonders and miracles. Right. We're talking about resurrection power, seeing seeing that power really flow and be demonstrated in the church. And all of a sudden I hear over the loudspeaker that there is a cold in the room where my relative was. So immediately I ran down while Prophet Sean was on the phone and said, wait a minute, something is going on in the room. But it was not my relative. It was the individual that was next to my relative. And immediately, Prophet Sean already praying in the Holy Ghost. Now I'm praying in the Holy Ghost. Yes. Because we were already in a moment, yes. the power of God was seen. And so they worked on it a little over 30 minutes. Yes. But the miraculous thing is, all of a sudden, Prophet Sean said, and I called his spirit back into his body. Wow. At that point, man of God, that's when I've seen many, they say, okay, they need sodium and a couple of other things to come in because now there was a heartbeat. But it showed the power of God and the power of our words. Wow. Our words are so powerful. And when you call his spirit back into his body, the heart of the story. But this is the thing that God put a signature wow. on it. The nurse came back in and said, There's a protocol. They worked on him a little longer than what the protocol called for. Wow. And the miracle was that his heartbeat came after the time of the protocol. Wow. Wow. So you're saying when we were on the phone and the, he was. Flatline dead. He was dead, dead. So he was flatline flat dead. dead. So when we were praying, we were praying in the Holy Ghost. You ran there, you saw him, they were working on him. And when when we when I spoke, I command his spirit to come back in the body. That's when that's, that's when, when they got a pulse. That's when they got a pulse. Wow. And they continued to work on him. And wow. the miracle was when the nurse came in and said it was a miracle because he was dead for over 30 minutes. So the nurse even confirmed that the it was a miracle. The nurse confirmed that it was a miracle. Because they usually don't work on someone that long. They have a protocol of how long they will work on somebody. Wow. They, and the protocol extended. Wow. And at the point when you said, I call for his spirit. Back into his body. I feel it all over again. Because it's such a desire. Yeah. It's a desire of Lord. It's right. a desire of mine to see the power of God right. in operation in our lifetime, in our midst. So, so would you say this is a confirmed resurrection from the dead? Confirmed resurrection from the dead. He was dead. Right. He was already gone. The, the, the nurse said he was dead. Wow. Wow. But they continue to work on him. Yes. They went beyond the protocol. Yes. But it's because we was at the right time, at the right, right place, place, doing the right thing. Yes. And yes. that God is ready to demonstrate his power. Yes. And so when you said, I call back his spirit, back into his body, mm. his spirit said, yes, sir. <laughs> and came back. And came back. And they got a call. Wow, wow. Well, you heard it here first. Uh, the woman of God confirmed the resurrection. This is the eyewitness account of the resurrection that took place. Let me tell you something. There's no distance in God's spirit. I believe, woman of God, as we pray right now, we can release that same resurrection power. I feel that anointing. That same resurrection power for those who are dating your marriage, dating your finances. You may be dating your physical body, but I believe right now, as we and the woman of God come together, just like we did on that phone, that right now the resurrection power is being released right now in the name of Jesus Christ and we command your spirit to come back into your body we command your finances to line up we command that your marriages be restored in the name of Jesus Christ and oh Lord you get 
take all the praise, honor, and glory out of this. And we thank you, Lord. We thank you because you are Lord. Hallelujah. We thank you. Thank you, Lord. God. We bless you.